Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I hope everybody is doing all right and staying lean during quarantine, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, yeah guys, I'm not gonna lie, I have been eating bad and uh, I have been lazy. I used to work out every day and uh, in quarantine, I don't have anywhere to go and work out. All I can do is go outside and run or go hiking or something, but I just don't feel like it. So I'm just being lazy, eating whatever chocolate ice cream uh, i'm getting a belly right now it's pretty bad <laughs> yeah guys so today we got an update in modern warfare and they added uh the chaos chaos shipment so it's a 10 v 10 um hold up it's a 10 v 10 uh shipment um and you can play cranked uh team death match uh grind hard point and domination literally you spawn and die you spawn and die you spawn and die uh if you're very smart you go in the very corners of you know um on the sea flag i would say i think it's best you are safer on the on the side of the sea flag so if you go there by the the container there's like a little truck uh you guys know what i'm talking about there's a dumpster and there's the other side so if you guys go to the other side not the dumpster uh, either way it works, honestly. Uh, you guys can get a lot of kills. They spawn in line in front of you, and uh, you guys can literally just uh, kill right off the spawn when they spawn back. And um, I I've been killing a lot, I'm not gonna lie. I've been running Wilson, um, Cluster Strike, and White Phosphorus. And when you do the combo of White Phosphorus with Wilson, it's insane. Because the enemies. When you use the white phosphorus, all the enemies, they are one shot. So it's basically playing hardcore on a 10v10 on core. So when you use the Wilson and the white phosphorus, you literally destroy the enemies. I swear, every Wilson, I can get at least like 40 kills. Uh, unless somebody destroys it with RPG or C4. But yeah... Uh, if you get the Wilson and White Phosphorus on shipment right now on this mode, you guys are going to drop over 100 kills easy. So just do this combo I'm telling you. Cluster Strike, Wilson, and um, White Phosphorus. And then on the perks, you use EOD Hardline and uh, you use Amped. And your secondary, you have to put the RPG. So put the RPG as secondary because sometimes they're all in the corner like camping. And then you shoot your RPG, you get, you get a triple kill easy. So that's like one triple kill and then two more kills. You already have your cluster strike, one more kill, you get your Wilson. And then you need three more for the white fosters. And that's it. It's easy peasy. Just try this. Um, and uh, let, me, let me know what you guys uh, think about the setup. And also, if you guys are brand new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe, like the button down below, that's very important. And also follow me on my Twitter and on my Twitch. So today's video, guys, um, one of the modes that I like to play, and I always played since BO1, uh, it is Capture the Flag. So Capture the Flag is basically like a demolition, but with spawns, but the, the difference is... It uses flags instead of the bombs, but the spawns are always the same. The spawn never changes. So every map, your enemies, they have two spawns. They have um, usually the left or right side. It depends. on Every map is different. So I was playing on Piccadilly. And um, Piccadilly, uh, I know the spawns there um and usually one side is behind the the buses and then the other spawn is inside the little uh, gallery that has all the windows broken and uh, the other side they spawn in the corner by the the telephone telephone cabin and behind the behind the car on the other side so basically they spawn on the other side but is uh on the left side of the building and then on the right side of the building the very corner so if you guys know the spawns on Piccadilly, if you guys play Capture the Flag, you guys can destroy. I swear. If you guys watch the gameplays, you guys are going to see uh, how I played it. And uh, I ended up getting a tactical nuke on Piccadilly. Wow. Piccadilly is horrible. I, I literally, the only thing you, it's, like, you can play on that map, I would say, is uh, Capture the Flag. 
honestly, or demolition. I don't I don't see myself playing um Piccadilly, like the uh, domination, hardpoint, headquarters. I used to play hardcore headquarter headquarters on on Piccadilly and stuff like that because I, I I played a lot of hardcore. But I really don't like the map and nobody does. But if you guys play Capture the Flag, remember if you guys play Capture the Flag, it's totally different. It's another story. You guys are gonna like it. Uh, trust me, I have games that I dropped over a hundred kills on Piccadilly. I have games that I dropped like 80, 70, uh, just playing capture the flag. And of course, make sure your your friends, your teammates don't capture all the flags. Because if your guys are killing a lot, it's uh, there's always that guy that goes and grabs the flag and keeps capturing the flag. And then it ends the match. So that's good to, to have friends so you guys can control the spawns and nobody is capturing like crazy the flags. So that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video and I appreciate all my new subs. I've been getting a lot of subs. We're about to hit 1,000 subs. Thank you guys so much for that and from all my OG subs and my new subs. And I hope in a few months we can get to maybe 10,000 subs. We'll see. All right. See you guys on the next video and thank you so much for watching. Capture the enemy flag and
Capture the enemy flag and return to fight. Sketchy as hell. Hard for well earned. Thank you, We nuked the fuck out of them. Boys, boys, on wins are not worth the virus. The boys' wars on wins are not getting. They're not worth getting my battle pass. Bam. Or my fucking 